Hello again guys, uh, in this tutorial series I'll be going over some of the basics um, in Windows XP and Windows 7, I might even try and throw in a bit of Windows Vista and I'll just be going over how you can do some of the simple things and just some useful tips that hopefully the people who won't be as experienced on the Windows operating system um, will be able to use them and do some good with them. So in this video I'll be talking about how you can uninstall um, a program in Windows XP. So if you wanted to do this you, you might for example have um, a, a spam program that every time you load the or turn your PC on it runs in the background and slows your computer and crashes but um, in this video I'll just be showing about how you can uninstall it through Windows. Just as an example, I'll be uninstalling IP Changer Extra, as it's the only thing I've got running on this virtual machine, but it should be the same procedure for any other um, setup. So, if you, the first thing you need to do is go to the Start menu. If you then go to Control Panel, you should either see a window like this, or like this. If you haven't gone to this screen before, it'll most probably be like this. So the thing I'd recommend doing is switching over to the classic view, which you can do so via this little button here, or this link here, should I say. So if you click that, you should see a window like all of us. So if you then go to the add and remove program button here, if you double click that, that should bring up a new window, and this should show you everything you have installed on your machine. If you then try and find the particular program you don't need or you want to remove and then click on it, you'd see some buttons here. Depending on the actual application itself, it might not have a change button, it might have some other buttons there, but the only one we really need is remove. So if you click the remove button, it'll ask you if you really want to remove this program from your computer. The answer is yes. Depending on the actual application itself, it might have a slightly different un uninstall wizard, or it might just do it automatically for you like it just did then. So that is a very quick video on how you can uninstall something from Windows XP. And I'll also try and do this through Windows 7, and maybe even a bit of Windows Vista on there, just so that you know how you can do it. If there's anything in particular you want to learn how you can do, then please leave a comment below and I'll make sure to do a video about it. If you've got any questions then again leave a comment below and I'll try and get back to you with it. If you like the video and want to see more of them then like and subscribe and if you didn't like the video then comment below and let me know why and I'll make sure to get back to you on that and hopefully improve the video for the rest of peop other people on here. So thank you very much for watching and hopefully I'll see you again in the next video.